Hey man, today we're checking out another Darman movie. Rich student pays kids to go to his birthday. Yo, I'm, I'm gonna keep it a buck, man. If, you, if you're that kid who has to pay people to go to your birthday, man. Bro, that is just down bad, man. But maybe there's a reason to it. We're just about to find out. You excited about your birthday party, Otis? Why not? We got a DJ. Catering from your favorite restaurant. I mean, yo, your if you're rich, then yeah. My friends. My only friend is Malcolm. I, I don't even understand why we printed so many invites. Well, we spent a lot on this party, sweetie, so I thought you'd want more people there. By the way, are you sure you don't want Drake to show up? No, I, I don't want to draw too much attention. Hmm? What? Yo, come on, man. You have money for a reason. Use it. Oh, no! that was Carlos's. Oh. Shoot! <laughs> Why are you ducking? I don't want anyone to see me. Yo, this is dope, my guys. Give me a ride. Just show them, bro. Oh, why would we have to take the Rolls Royce today? Sweetie, I told you the Porsche's in the shop. Can you just drop me off in the back, please? What? Come on, man. Those kids would love being seen getting out of a Rolls Royce. I would. I don't want anyone to judge me or think I'm pretentious. This is crazy. Can we please just drop me off around that? All right, sweetie. Arnold, would you mind looping around to the back to drop Otis off? Thank you. Ah, oh, bro, come on. I would die to be dropped off in that. Have a good day at school, sweetie. I'll try. <laughs> Why didn't you? Don't get... ask. Let's just get out of here before anyone sees. Yo, Broski, yo, was that you that just got out that Rolls Royce? Shh. Uh, I, I didn't. Bro, that totally was you that got out that car, bro. That's so dope. Bro, you have a friend right there, <sighs> yeah, man. Come on. Yeah, that was me. Just, just, please, don't say anything. Shh. Don't say anything, bro. If that was me. I'll be doing laps around this entire school just so everybody knew. Yeah, man, you got love from this guy. Ball. Come on. Really? You're not judging me? Judging you? Why would I judge you, bro? bro. Oh, it's busting, bro. I can't imagine what your house is like. Uh, well, I, um, having a birthday party if, if you'd like to come. Yo, you having a birthday? Yo, for real? Like me? For real, bro? Bro, you got a friend, oh, man. Oh, bro, you live in Beverly Hills? Like, like, like in the hills of Beverly? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, man, come on, man. Yo, hey, I'm gonna be there, my boy. I'm gonna be there, my boy. I'm gonna, you gonna be there? Yeah, you gonna be there, dog, right? Hey, I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna be there. Hey, look, I'm gonna be there. I'm... Yo, uh, I like that, bro. He's getting I friends. I guess I'm gonna have two people coming to my birthday party. Come on, man. Get more people. Can I be of any help? Oh, 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 yeah, dude, I am so stoked to see the new Ghostbusters movie <laughs> after school. I know. I was worried that the Afterlife sequel was going to be like a rehash of what the last films did, but this actually looks cool and original. Yeah. Wait, what's up? Are you, are you not eating? I actually think I'm going to eat the lunch I brought. But I, uh, I thought you were afraid of people judging you for having a fancy chef-made lunch. What happened to that? Yo, Owen! I'm gonna be your friend, man. I'm gonna be your friend. Yeah, but I'm starting to think that being rich may not be such a bad thing after all. Yeah, like, bro, come on. Instead of people judging me, they might actually think I'm cool, you know? Uh, like, you saw how you to... Briggs reacted when he saw me step out of the Rolls Royce. So you have to okay. you don't pay him, though. Yeah, but I mean, don't you think it's a little off that he only wanted to come to your party? after finding out that you have a Rolls and that you live in uh, the Beverly Hills, uh, the Hills Hills, as he calls it. I mean, I don't know. I just, but yo, it's like everyone's you friends respecting with you like when that. you get money. Okay, so what's the alternative? Have no friends? Do I not come? Of course you do, I, but I don't want just one friend at my party. It's pathetic. Just think about it. A DJ spinning disc for two nerds at a mansion party. It yeah, would be yeah, so much cooler cool. if I had like a like hundred yeah, people bro. there. Okay, let me ask you something. Would you rather have four quarters or a dollar? A dollar? Bro, stick with me, just answer the question. A dollar, I guess. Exactly. My dad used this analogy with me. He says, when it comes to friendship, it's better to have a dollar than it is to have 100 pennies or 20 nickels or 10 dimes. Or well, why is that? I, I want to understand the logic. 
Guess and your dad never had to go to a laundromat. <sighs> okay, I don't really get where you're going. Ooh, he's getting the girls. Oh, why are they? Why did they make it so dramatic, man? Close your mouth. You're practically drooling. Sorry, Emma just walked in. Why don't you just invite her to your birthday? What's the point? I've invited her every year and she's never showed. Like, actually invited her or like slipped an invitation into her locker? Invited no, her. Like, you gotta have a human, human connection. What difference does it make? Either way, she doesn't even know I exist. Hey, hey, you. Oh my gosh. Am I dreaming? I'm dreaming. Why'd you do this? I didn't say hi to me. Um, hi. Uh, 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 hey, Emma. So, is it true? Briggs said that you got dropped off in a Rolls Royce? Uh, yeah, yeah, I did. Uh, see, I told you Owen got dropped off in a Rolls Royce. Oh, my name isn't Owen. It's what does your dad do? Um, actually, my mom, uh, she owns her own consulting company. Wow, so you're like really, really rich, huh? And I heard that you're having a party at your mansion in the hills? Yeah, I am. It's, it's for my birthday. Oh, well, do you think uh, we could get an invite? Yeah, of course. I mean, just... Why is he mumbling, bro? Yo, he does not know how to talk to girls. That is so... Uh, here you go. That is Great. so Thanks. desperate. Uh, so how he is. just... Like, yo, man. My gosh, he does not my gosh. know how to talk to girls. Emma actually just talked to me. What's that awesome or what? In a word? No. Oh, does she clearly only want to come to your party because you've got money. Save for that Briggs guy. I mean, she didn't even know your name, Owen. Uh, the, sorry, uh, were you <laughs> saying something? I, I, I couldn't hear you over my heart pounding. I mean, Emma's actually coming to my birthday party. Yeah, because you live in a mansion. Is that something really worth celebrating? By the way, what are you guys doing after school? Uh, we're actually going to see the new Ghostbusters movie. Oh. I didn't know you were busy. <sighs> Never mind. Wait, uh, why? What's up? Well, Julia Nicole and I were talking about going shopping for outfits. You know, for your gonna birthday. gonna make them pay. Gotta be cool if you guys came. Uh, no, sorry, we've been playing. Yeah, we'd love to. The, the movie seemed lamed anyway. I'm not, I'm not even that big of a Ghostbusters fan. You're wearing a Ghostbusters t-shirt. Okay, great. Also, do you think we could ride in the Rolls Royce? Uh, yeah, of course. I don't see why not. Perfect. Let me put my number in your phone. <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> Is that your lunch? Yeah, my chef made it for me. A mansion, a Rolls Royce, and a chef? It looks really good. You mind if I have some? Oh, of course. I mean, you can have it all. If ah, Brolski. Really? Thank you. Here. I'll see you after school. <laughs> ah, Brolski. Simp. He's a now, simp, bro. Now I've got five people coming to my party. That's, that's like the most I've ever had. He's eating a Mr. Ooh, Feast burger. I've never seen a Rolls Royce in person before. It's crazy. Same. Whose car is that? Guilty as charged. That's my ride. Hey, bro. That's so cool. Oh my gosh. Oh my it's gosh. so cool. Come on. <laughs> That's so cringe, bro. Oh my gosh. You even have someone to open the door for you? This is Graham worthy. Can you get a pic of us? Sure. Oh man. Fake flexing. <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> Bro, he's got all the girls, man. Shoot. I, I don't think all five of us are going to fit. There's only room for four. Would you mind getting an Uber? Make the girls get an Uber. Come on, man, he's your day one. You gotta take him. 
So, what do you think? You look... Wow. You look wow. Uh, that dress is This is cringe, incredible. bro. Aw, thanks, Oscar. It's actually Otis, but, but, but that's fine. Ooh, how's that dress working out for you? I love it. It fits perfect. Well, you are lucky, because today it's 10% off, bringing it down to $1,000. $1,000? Mm -hmm. I don't have that kind of money. Ah, bro. <laughs> You should offer to pay for it. Yeah, that'd be really sweet. Like a total knight in shining armor moment. <sighs> well, since I can't afford uh, it. I'll buy it for you. <laughs> really? You're the best. Well, why don't you come with me to the register and we will ring that dress up. <laughs> Look, girls, that was perfect. And don't worry, I'll get him to get you guys something too. Do you think Gucci would be a stretch? I really want a handbag. Wait, what are you gonna wear to your party? His is tomorrow, but yours is tonight. You can't be seen wearing a better dress at his party than at yours. You are what? so right. Ugh, I didn't think of that. Just ask him to buy you another dress for you to wear tonight, too. Oh, no, because then I have to invite him to the party, and I don't want some loser there. Oh, I'll just tell Oscar I want two dresses for his birthday. You think he'd go for it? If Taylor Swift can do outfit changes, so can I. You're not I'll just split with him a little and, I don't know, ask him as my date. Sweet. Yeah, thanks, man. These are the nicest shoes I've stuff? ever seen. No worries. <laughs> My mom probably won't even notice the charge on the credit card. <laughs> That's what's up. I heard you were having a mansion party. Oh, yeah, you guys should totally come. There you go. <laughs> right on. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. Bro, what oh, the hell, man? We need man? to talk. Um, I heard Emma talking in the fitting room, and dude, they're just using you. Okay. So? So? What, did you not just hear what I just said? Dude, I, I said that they're using Using you. me. I know. You really think I don't know that? I may not have friends, but I'm not dumb. Okay, so then if you know that they're using you- Do you, you have just... any idea what it's like to be the only person never invited to anything? and never have anyone show up to their parties. Yeah, but you For don't want fake people. the first time in my life, I... I feel like I'm not invisible. Look, man, I'm... I'm sorry. Okay, but I, I can't just stand around and watch people take advantage of you, even if you're okay with it. To be honest, I, I'd rather just be us. Your birthday party, you know, rather than a bunch of... fake friends who don't even care about you. But if that's what you want to do, then... Got me out. Wait. You'd seriously not come to my party? We've been best friends since like the sixth grade. And I wish you'd take my advice. Hey! Some of the girls want to go to the party, and I was wondering if I can send them the invites. Yeah. The more the merrier. On, man. When you come to realize that a dollar is better than a hundred pennies, notify me. I thought it was four quarters. Everything okay with your friend? Uh, yeah. Uh, don't worry about him. He's he's fine. So, uh, who else wants to come? Basically, everyone at Bookside. You like overnight became the most popular kid in school. Really? Wow. Yeah. And since there's going to be a lot of people there, I was thinking I'd do an outfit change. Have two dresses, since I'm going to be your date, right? What do you think? Yes. If he knows it, then why is he doing it? I don't know, man. Thanks so much for taking us shopping. We had the best time. Yeah, my wardrobe was in need of a huge refresh. And I can't wait to post all these outfits on my story. Hey, yo, we'll see you tonight. Uh, no, 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 my uh, party's tomorrow. Yeah, I know that. I'm talking about Emma's party tonight. I'll see you later. Uh, you're having a party tonight? 
Uh, I wouldn't say it's a party. I mean, there's not even going to be any music. It's more like a, a small get together with some close friends I've known for like ever. Didn't Briggs just move here last year? We met at summer camp as kids. <laughs> anyway, uh, thanks again. And I can't wait to you see you. Can't even invite home. him now after he called you out? That is. That's horrible. Yo, some people are just douchebags. Come on, man. Hey, honey. Your grandparents got you a birthday card. You okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. You sure? <sighs> Malcolm said something to me earlier about real friends, and I'm starting to realize that maybe either. He's right. Actually, Mom, I, I just got invited to a party. Can I go? What? Now? Is it a little... Come on, Mom. What's the last time I got invited to a party? Please, please, please. Okay, uh... I'll have Arnold take you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Hello? I'm not a Ghostbusters fan. Yeah, you gotta switch out the clothes. Wear something a little exquisite. Not that, bro. When we say... Wear something good. We don't mean hey, oh, no traffic shirts. Oh, am I not coming inside? Actually, that's not why I texted you. I was wondering if I could borrow some money. <sighs> okay. You know, I saw your story, and it looks like a little more than just a small get together. I only invited like five people. A bunch came. I'm really annoyed. Trust me. Anyway, um. Can you help me? I mean, I wouldn't ask if it was an emergency. How much do you need? Like 50. Thousand? I mean, 300. 300? Briggs thought it'd be a good idea to skate inside, so he broke the TV. And I need to fix that before my parents get back, because if they find out I have a party, they'll kill me. I'll be grounded for like a month. <sighs> Which means I won't be able to go to your party, and you'll have to find a new date. Fuck you. Please, Otis. No, oh, bro. Has a girl never touched your hands? Like, wow. You know my name. Of course I know your name. We're friends. And friends help each other in times of need, don't they? <sighs> okay. Such a good friend. I'll see you tomorrow. A Isn't friend. that the dress that I got? <sighs> the plan oh! to break. I have the money to buy more drinks. Thank goodness you told me that door to me, Mouth. I would have totally blown it. Uh, come on, man. Not worth it. Bro, you, you would rather just go to the strip club, bro. To be honest, that's better. We might be looking at a second ice age. What are you doing here? Why does here? he always wear graphic t-shirts, bro? Your party started like an hour. What's the point of a party if my best friend's not going to be there? So notice I already told you I'm not going to your I'm not here party. to convince you to come to my party. I'm here to apologize. I was thinking about what you said and I realized you're right. It is better to have one real friend rather than a hundred fake ones. I got so caught up in being popular that I forgot about the one person who's always had my back. Glad I'm he sorry. found out. It's okay. I get it. Listen, you know I always have your back. Come here. <laughs> Thanks, man. So, what do you say we see the new Ghostbusters movie? Wait, but what, what about your party? Didn't you invite, like, half the school yeah but i texted everyone and said it was canceled well almost everyone i didn't text emma i found her mom's number and messaged her instead <gasps> <laughs> got him oh
fuck? Mom, Dad, you're home early? Did you throw a party last night? What? Where'd you even hear that? Some unknown person texted me this. Care to explain? Oh, shoot. I forgot I lent Emma all that money. I'm a little short. You're the credit oh, card, you, bro. Thanks. All right. Nice Who are you gonna call? Call Spencer! Na 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 na. Woo! All right, man. That was a good one, bro. Rich kid, student pays kids to go to his birthday. Phenomenal, bro. Phenomenal, man. I like how he understood at the end that, yo, it's better to have a dollar than have a hundred pennies or four quarters or ten dimes, 20 nickels. You get the gist. But yeah, I, I really like this message a lot. But I'm sure he could have called the skateboard guy. He seemed, he didn't seem like an asshole. Maybe some of them were. But I guess a small majority, I mean, small minority weren't. He could have invited those people, but I guess all that matters is that he's with his real friend, right? But that is the video, man. I'm going to rate this an 8.2 out of 10. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.